All right, hello, my fellow Vault Dwellers, and welcome to episode number six of my Fallout 3 uh, Let's Play. And um, last episode, we, we got into Minefield, and we got all the, the mines that we could possibly get. Uh, had some, some issues with uh, with getting them. Um, we got pretty screwed up, too. Um, as you can see, our gun's not steady. Uh, our aim's not steady. Um, that's because we're, we're severely damaged here. Um, if I look at our health. Um, this is, we're pretty bad off here. Um, and with the Fallout Edition installed, we can't, um, heal any of these with a stim pack. We, we really need to see a doctor. So, um, I was going to go to, um, the police station, but, I mean, we're, we are so screwed up. Like, if I bring up the, um, the sniper rifle, I mean, it's going to be hard to get a shot in. And we're going to be going up against, you know, um, mutants. <laughs> you know, it's going to be pretty tough. So I think we're going to be better off just maybe heading back to see more, get ourselves healed up. And then we'll go help the people of, um, of Big Town, I think. Uh, we promised them we would do that. So I, I think it's only fair uh, that we do. So I'm going to head back um, very cautiously. Hopefully we don't run into too much resistance. Um, well, I think we're, we'll be able to survive a, a, a huge fight, so. At least with the scopes now, we can kind of look ahead. Um, hopefully see anything that's coming. I don't know why there was a light change there. I don't know if it's because my head screwed up, maybe. You know, that part of me wasn't really the... Wasn't screwed up as much as the, the rest of me. Let's see. Um, head more south, but I think... Yeah, we should probably go up through this way. Being very cautious of raiders and any other unsavory characters in the area. Even though you've been through a, an area in this game, it, it they spawn pretty regularly, so I saw somebody up there. Oh, uh, near radiation. Yeah, I think... Oh, yeah, right there, probably. I hope that's just a regular bug and not those bees. Yeah, I think so. Oh, what do we have there? Oh, uh, okay. They won't bother us. In fact, if they were going the same way we were, we'd probably walk with them, but... Uh, am I even going the right way? This doesn't look right. I don't think so. Alright, um... Yeah, okay. This direction. Alright, got some raiders over there. I think we're far enough away that they won't bother us. Keep our eye on them, though. Not gonna bother looking for us too much because we can't really carry anything. My main goal right now is to get back alive. <laughs> trying to figure out exactly where we are too, because I think that's the broken bridge. Which we're not gonna be able to get across, so we're gonna have to go more. Oh crap.
Switch. Thank you. <sighs> Don't know why he wouldn't switch on me. Yeah, so that's the problem. Is that we're so damaged now that we are going to get crippled pretty easily. See, I think I did get another uh, brace, medical brace. Go to triage. Okay, so we can move around. I don't think we could do anything in triage. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So we definitely need to go see a doctor. Probably would have been a lot easier if I had gone back the way I came. But, I mean, who likes easy? <laughs> Alright, yeah, we have to hit one this way. Don't have a lot of bolts for this gun, but it is super powerful. Yeah. Uh That's not a good area to walk through, I don't think. Alright, I think... Okay, I know where we are. This is where we... Um, we were last time. Well, not last time, but we fought these raiders. Let's see if there's anything we missed. Maybe some medical supplies or something. I don't think so. I'm pretty thorough. The latrine. <laughs> All right, let's get back over this bridge. We gotta watch out there were some uh, mutants over this side. I wonder if that is that the no, it's not the headquarters. So the police department's up this way. In there somewhere, okay. But well, they were near that. Looks like it looks like a church. So they were near that. I saw that. I saw them kind of milling around there. So I don't know if we need to go through there first or well. well I guess we'll find out. But now let's just try to get back alive. will be okay in this section anyways. I also think we increased our, if I remember correctly, our explosive um, skill. So we might be able to disarm that bomb now too. Which would be nice. Alright. 
So... I'm gonna cut across. Alright. It's one of the en enclave bots. Not gonna bother us. I can see Megaton from here. Awesome. I think I'm going to stop in, too, at the Satchel Place and get, um... I don't know if it's called the Satchel Place, but... <laughs> get a backpack or something like that. Um, I think it's up here. It's a mod that's installed. It is, uh... Yeah, it's over this way. I think I might have enough um, bottle caps now. I'm going to be able to carry a little bit more. Alright, so we can get a Nomad backpack. Um, satchel. So let's see. With the backpack, we can add twenty. We can add twenty-five pounds, but our sneak goes down by ten. Hmm. You know, I think I'd rather carry the more weight. Sixty-three caps. Yeah, we got plenty. I wonder if I can sell them stuff. Yeah, but he only has 51 caps, though, so... If I do that... Okay, it does add to him. Alright, let's see. I don't know if I really have anything I can sell. Yeah, we'll sell some of the drugs. That might be useful in certain situations. So yeah, the cigarettes. Yeah, we really need a place to stop putting stuff, I think. Give me a shout if you need any. Bye. All right, let's go. Put, let's put this thing on. All right, that's cool. And now we can carry more stuff. So I, I, I like that. All right, where is Megaton? There it is. See the doctor first. Get ourselves healed up. Hey, hey, what's up? What's up? Sheriff. 
So this guy calls us a big baby. You came in here on your own power, so you must not be busted up too bad. <laughs> yeah, look at me. Well, now, let's take a look at you. Some second-degree burns, a couple of flesh wounds. It'll take some work, but I can fix you up for 75. All right, there you go. That's cheaper than before. Here. Hold this for me while I stitch you up. <laughs> what are you doing? All better now, you big baby. Can I get back to work now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, then. I don't think being crippled and all that stuff is makes me a big baby. See, that's better. Now watch. See, I'm much more steadier. I mean, it still moves a little bit, but not as bad. Oh, maybe it is just as bad. <laughs> all right, why is it? It seems like that's moving a lot more than usual. Um... That's set to one, that's right. I think so was it gun oil? Um Current hand drift is vanilla sixty five percent. Okay. Apparently I need to um Probably increase my gun skill then. Just seems like I'm moving a lot more, but that's good. It, it was way worse before. Alright, I should be able to disarm this now. Alright. Yeah, let the sheriff know. Oh, I should put this away. <laughs> I'll be damned. You did it, didn't I you? Did, yeah. You disarmed that thing. Damn Here's straight, your reward. Hell, why don't you move in? Could use someone like you. Got an empty place here you can use. Here's the key indeed. How convenient. There ain't much to look at, <laughs> but talk with Moira. She's got random odds and ends you might be able to spruce the place up with. All right, very good. All right, thank you. Take care now. All right, so we did that, and now we have a house. So we have a place we can settle in a little bit. It's getting kind of dark, too, so we can sleep. Uh, well, it's not dark yet, but you know what I mean. It is uh, now currently... Almost 1800 hours, so oh, she might not be open. I guess she is. I don't even know it's only like 5 o'clock, 6 o'clock, so. Uh, nope, I get. How are those hot little potatoes? Those hot little potatoes are because, pain in the ass. You know, they're on the ground. Like potatoes. And hot because they, um, explode. Yeah, right in my face. Anyway, what's up? And if you ever get close to one that's near tree branches, go around the branches. Trying to go through them just does not work. Uh, let's... Yeah. Well, I did make it kind of alive. My very own landmine! Oh, just what I've always wanted. Well, always since I sent you out on this anyway. Yeah, now, tell me all about it. What was it like going through there? Scary? What's it like disarming a landmine? Scary? <laughs> Uh, yeah, I... <laughs> yeah, just jump up and down. You go first. Um, yeah, I guess it is a death trap. Lots of places are nowadays. Good work staying alive in tough conditions. It'll be a great example for the book. I know you may not want to see any more explosives for a while, but obviously you know your way around them. Have a couple rainy day toys of mine. And looking at okay. this landmine gives me an idea. It's a terrible device that does terrible things, of course. But it's easy to make your own, too. All right, cool. Thank you. Well, we got some frack grenades. And we got schematics to a bottle cap mine, which is very helpful. Um, yeah, so that completes the first chapter. Yep, you've done a great job. Thank you. I just need to add in the section on how to cook rat. And this chapter's done. What? Here, for your services, I've saved up quite a few stim packs. 
Of course, you may need them. We still've got two more chapters to go. Yeah. Um I think I got to take a break from that well, for now. Well, I can't force you to work, I suppose. Well, the people of Big Town need my help. I I'm sorry. Um so but Good I have to go. I want research. to check out my new place. All right. And we can talk to her to get um, different uh, enhancements to the house. But for now, I don't think we need anything. Just just to be able to store stuff. A very nice to make your acquaintance. I'm your new Robo Butler. Okay, Robo Butler. So it's good we can put our bottle heads in here. Um, I believe I do have one. And you still get the effects of it. So that kind of place to put your collectible stuff. And then we can put our stuff in here. Food in here. Whatever. It doesn't really matter where you put it. Place to sleep. Perfect. Alright, cool. It's good to see you alive. Now I'm wondering things, if sir. you know, I just thought about that. If um If I slept, if this would have healed. Because they, they were... I cured the cripple limbs. But they were just weak. I'm wondering... Maybe I should try that next time. Just to see. I never really... I didn't really think of it. Alright. Anyways. Let's put some stuff that we don't need. Uh, let's see. I, I think I'm going to part with the laser pistol for now. Uh, we don't need that many frack mines. So we'll put... We'll take like 10 with us. Now we'll decrease the weight a bit. Um, frack grenades. Yeah, we'll take, take a few of those. Bottle cap mines. Uh, we'll store those for now too. I think it's important that we keep our, our weapons. So we don't need to carry these things around with us anymore. Um, at least for now, anyways. <laughs> um, what else can we put in here? So I think in order to read these books, I need a, a perk for that. Yeah, try to read it. It's confusing. Need What is it? 35 plus skill to read. So any of these ones we can't read, I'll just... Yeah, I think that's going to be up for all of them. Yeah, okay. We'll just put them in here for now. And we don't need to keep all our stuff here. Um, I, I do... I forget what I needed for the medical kit. I think it was forceps. I think I need a lunch box. I need one of these. Scapel. I think I need a bone saw. Uh, I'll keep some of the surgical supplies because I think that's needed when I get hurt. I'll put that in there too, the wonder glue. Don't need to carry those. Don't need to carry the mini nuke. And keep some of those in case we find something that, that uses them. So let's just kind of clean this up a little bit too. 10 millimeter. I don't know if I have anything that has 10 millimeter rounds. But apparently these these don't add weight. I thought they did. It, maybe that's a setting in fall, the Fallout edition that I don't have set. Uh, I'm not going to worry about it though. Alright, so what's our weight now? Um, yeah, okay, that's better. Alright, we don't have a workbench yet. So we'll, we'll worry about that right now. I'll just, I'll just hold on to that medical stuff. Um... 
All right, so what do you do? Allow me to introduce myself. I am Wadsworth, your personal robotic butler. I am here to look after your needs and to keep you happy and entertained. What can I do for you? Ah, nothing right now. <laughs> I'll be sure and tidy up while you're away, sir. Sure. And if, I don't know if I ever want to get a haircut because that looks like if that will hurt. Alright, we can put some food in here. We'll keep some of the water, even though it's dirty water. Yeah, that's good enough. All right, so let's just get a quick nap here, quick sleep, and then we'll we'll head back out. Let's see, six in the morning. Yeah, we'll wake up to some sunlight, I guess. All right, all right, let's go help those people at Big Town. <clears throat> oh, I'm probably thirsty and hungry, huh? I think of that. Oh, yeah. Oh, I got food on me. What am I doing? Let's see. Yeah, we're drinking Nuka Cola. And mmm, iguana bits. Num num. I'm still a little bit hungry. Let's see what else do we have? Insta mash. Insta mash did nothing. Oh, there we go. Okay. This just takes a, a little bit. Yeah, I'm stuck. There we go. All right. Off to help those people. Stop breathing heavy, you big baby. I am a big baby. Talk this right. Empty? Yep. You know what we can do too? This Springville ML Elementary School has radars in it. Maybe we should clear this out. What's going on over there? Doesn't look too good, though. She's freaking out. I think I want to go in that door. Let's see. Um... Some mines down, just in case. Do 
stop going crazy. Oh, there we go. Let's take this stuff. We can use it to fix that bike. Diet maintenance. You see Ed's. Ed's dead. <laughs> That's funny. Alright, I'm sorry. I'll be right back. Okay, uh, sorry about that. I had to go. Uh, my phone was ringing, but um, <laughs> when I came back, the game crashed, so... <laughs> uh, not a good... Uh, not a good thing to happen. I'm not sure why it, it crashed, but... Um, I mean, it, it happens periodically so I have the the auto save uh, mod installed um, but yeah it's pretty pretty strange um, but yeah all right, we'll just continue on all right um, I don't know if we should go through that way or go through this you know I want to pick up my mines Happened to the third mine. Hmm, it's odd. I did put three mines down, right? Yeah, I only have nine now. Huh. All right. Maybe it will appear when we come back out. has a bat, so. Oh. That's a crowbar. Well, I'm sure there's nobody else out here because they would have shot me already. The Raiders would have went through the stuff already. good drugs in the in the bathroom all right so we can go in this way go top hmm Where's the other one that was getting all crazy and wiggly? I 
if I can get up there. Yeah, the stairs there. I mean, yeah, maybe she's over there or he's over there. Must have disappeared after she got all freaky. Alright, um, I think I'll go in this top door, work my way, yeah, work my way down. Alright, so let's see. I'm gonna change some of my weapons around here. I'm not really going to be using a hunting rifle inside, I don't think. So, um, make that my first choice. Second. Third. And fourth. the best. behind me what there's nobody out here all right I call unfair <laughs> all right well in that case I'm gonna play unfair too some time here. I 
heard somebody. Yeah, I can hear them talking or yelling, whatever they're doing. Wish I had more bullets for that. Yeah, it seems like I shot them off a lot. What is making that noise? Driving me nuts. <laughs> I think it's the pot. <laughs> Alright. Well, I ended up crippling myself with the, uh, the mine placement, but oh well. Ah. Ah, what's that? Oh, this guy was like heavily armed, wasn't he? Oh. All right, there's somebody out there. Oh, sounds like a dog. Eh? Take that. Oh, <laughs> Anybody else? Okay. All right, let's take a look around here. Then we'll take a look, see what we got, too. Dripping all over me, gross. <laughs> so that was a nice couple of stim packs back there. Lunchbox. So with the lunchbox, we can make the bottle cap mines now. Which I believe are actually more damaging than the um, fruck mines, I, I think. I mean, there's got to be some benefit to use up some of your caps to make a, a mine, so. Even though a lot of games like this, once you get going, you know, the, um, you don't really need as many caps as you, as you would. Because you can find a lot of stuff in your own, make a lot of stuff in your own. was a bad move, wasn't it? Try to jump up on that and he didn't jump. <laughs> 
Oof. Okay, uh, it worked out pretty well. So hopefully we can find a combat knife. We can find a medical brace somewhere because we are injured in our arm. It doesn't seem to be affecting us so badly. I can hear that body moving around up there. Must be right above us. <laughs> Bathrooms are a good source of drugs. Is this where all the junkies go? That's stem path. Nice. Bone saw. Alright, cool. I think we needed that for our medical kit. And I believe what that does is it increases my medicine skill level. I think. I hear something. Is it somebody moving around? Alright, I think, um, don't think we're alone. If we do get affected by uh, by being crippled, I can always inject some morphine in me. Hand-me-down raider. Oh, medical brace. Oh, and hand-me-down raider armor. That's odd. I'll take that for a second. Alright. Let's, uh... Alright. First, let's try to... Fix our crippled state here. Let's take a look at what we have. Five millimeter. GMP. Huh. That's pretty cool. This is the first time I've ever seen this gun. <laughs> I think. I don't ever recall seeing that. Um, all right, Chinese pistols uses a 10 millimeter, so this does, so this is better. Repair this at all? Alright, uh, um, so out of shotgun, we should be able to repair a little bit. Also, you guys, so you can even use tin cans to do it, and the baseball bat, actually, because it's made out of wood. That's that's our completely damaged, but we'll just sell it. Don't have any ammo for that now, so I'm gonna take that. Make that my first choice now. 
That's a pretty neat gun. Five millimeter. And usually, I mean, in the past games I've played, I've never really used the, um, the only one gun I've ever seen used the five millimeter is the, the big auto gun. Um, I forget what you call it, but I usually just break those down for, um, for the gunpowder and everything. But, hell, this gun turns out to be pretty good. Might be using a lot of five millimeters. I mean, it's a small, small ammo, so I don't know how, how effective it's going to be, especially against um, heavier armed individuals. Because Fallout Edition cr makes the... Uh, okay, so we're back here. This is where I jumped down and fell. <laughs> um, Fallout Edition makes the heavy armor, or the, the power armor, I should say. Um... Very strong. Alright, so we need to find our way. See, I was already in here, but I did not see that right away. Did I miss anything else in here? No. Put our light on for now. I don't, I don't think there's anybody else down here. i to find some stairs. I don't think we've been through this section. That's right, because I heard the... Uh, Heard all that. Okay, there's the stairs going up. They're in there. And those are stairs going down. Alright, so it's gonna go we're gonna go back up. I wanna go where that dog was. And then we head back down. I think we have uh, the key to the basement. We got off that other uh, raider, so. Came in. Someone's over here. Oh, hello. Oh, wow. She had a Chinese assault rifle. Oh, she would have destroyed me. I yeah, probably not. <laughs> Actually, the way my day is going, yeah, maybe. <laughs> that was a new type for around 4.7. Hmm. Can't get into this one. Alright, I might be able to attempt a breach. I'll try one more time. I don't, I don't want to waste it because it's ammo. I mean, the ammo is pretty hard to come by, but I'd hate to waste it and find out that it's nothing there. All right, let's see what we have here. Poo poo died like a bitch. <laughs> I have, have a good idea of setting up here. We had a good thing going, picking off caravans and traders on their way to Megaton. Uh, so they were uh, attacking um, pa uh, travelers. But they killed them. <laughs> uh, the damn vault that we should be trying to get into. Not this one. Oh, they're trying to get into the vault. What? Is there a vault? Oh. So they're digging tunnels down down in the uh, basement. Oh, okay, and that's why the building's so destroyed. They they set explosives and it it collapsed. Get a goddamn hive of ants. <laughs> Uh, well, it 
looks like they were trying to get into probably Vault 101, uh, digging their way through, which is actually kind of smart. Um, you know, as readers go, I guess. And um, they came across a hive of ants. Luckily, luckily for Vault 101, so. Let's see what we can find down there. That was on already. Oh, I hear walking. Silent. That sucks. Yeah, oh shit. <laughs> Man, yeah, that gun's not good at all. Doing the jive, man. Thank you. Don't think I got the other one, did I? Still hear movement. Yeah, that was a bad grenade throw. It bounced right off the pipe. <laughs> Alright, that brings me back in. So that must have been what the other door was, the other stairs. What was that? No, nothing at all. That it chased me. <clears throat> Come on, you bastard. Kinda hate not knowing where they are. Lucky, wasn't it? <laughs> uh, I guess my mind got him. <laughs> I didn't even know they were there. I just kind of threw it because it showed that I had somebody. <laughs> and then the guy ran into the mine. That's awesome. <laughs> I love playing with explosives. <laughs> Alright. 
so it must have been this mod you got. Yeah. Where is he? All right. Is that all you had was a shovel? Really? All right, I got you. There's my mind. All right, here we go. So what is all that? It must be the ants I'm hearing. Oh, it's empty. Alright, that is a horrible sound. Check our stuff. So I kept hearing me clear my throat. I'm not that thirsty. Slightly hungry, but not bad. Alright, let's go in. Don't think we're going to find too many readers down here, if any. That sounds like more ants. That's a dead end. <laughs> Bad joke, I know. <laughs> Could have done the uh, Pink Panther theme. Dead end. Dead end. <laughs> I just did. Oh, I'm horrible. <laughs> All right. That's another ant. Soon to be dead. Let's see if I can hit him from here. Kind of. Oh crap, there's more. Oh, hello. Certainly a lot of them. Ooh. Ooh, nice. TM T6M fancy so that's the one of the mods I put in. Don't look that fancy, does it? But at least it's not um missing. <laughs> Instead of just having just a head and, and a couple of hands and I think that was pretty much it. All right, 
Alright, ooh, stem pack. Ooh, another one. Nice. Now that we got a sight rifle, we got a Chinese um, assault rifle. We're making up pretty good down here. One twenty five and then the what is it? Sorry, right for one twenty one. It's actually better, and they're about the same condition too. I mean, it's only a little bit better. Very nice. And this is this will work out good against um, mutants and things like that. Bigger rounds, more damage. Alright, we pretty much cleared this out. So bad we got crippled once. Yeah, you know it happens. Been through worse. This shouldn't have mines blowing up in our faces. <laughs> Alright, it's gotta be a way out. There was a way out, wasn't there? Um perimeter here to make sure we didn't miss anything. Yeah, we checked out that. That's Ed. Ed's dead. <laughs> we run around here with our new assault rifle. Oh! Alright. That's toxic waste right there. Go near that. <laughs> Alright, I believe we are clear. No more raiders, no more giant ants. Springvale is now safe once again. Let's head back to Megaton. I don't think we need to see the doctor. Um, I think if I rest long enough, um, my limbs will heal. That was the limb we, we fixed. So you see like the, the stat and that's how much damage. So if I get hit there, obviously I'm, I'm going to get crippled. But if I rest, it should heal up. So we don't need to talk to anybody. There was no, it wasn't really a mission that we did. We did that on our own. Um, but we'll go in here and, and I'll, I'll sort through stuff. Um, get myself healed up and then we'll head out to Big Town and rescue those people. Um, but for now, we're going to end the episode here. I thank you for watching. Um, please remember to hit that like button. Um, you can also follow me on Twitter. I have a, a Twitter account. It's at Pitch Dark Gaming. Um, so when I post videos, it automatically uh, updates Twitter. Um, things like that. So... Uh, if you're interested in following the series, it's probably one of the one of the best ways. Also, to subscribe, um, you should get notification that a new video is uh, has been posted. Um, I thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.